Welcome back to the Home Kit Life channel. I'm Josh and I got my cameraman Brayden here with me today and we are going to review the Nano Leaf A19 Essential Bulb today. Let's get that thing unboxed. It's a pretty simple bulb, right? It looks like a bulb. I love the uh, kind of hex shape that it's got going on here uh, on the top of the bulb. It does, it's got a, the home kit code attached to it. It also comes with this little card here that has the home kit code on it. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I'm pretty happy with these things. Let's, uh, let's swap out the hue bulbs that I have in this office for uh, one of these nano leaf bulbs and see what it looks like. We've got the nano leaf bulbs installed. Um, we, we screwed them in, obviously, that's all the installation it takes. Uh, and now what I wanted to do is just go ahead and I've got most of them in the home kit here. Uh, but we'll just go ahead and get this last one added. You can see in HomeKit, you just scan the code. It says connecting to light. Uh, in order to do this video, we did, uh, we had this one added, we removed it. We actually had a good bit of trouble. We had to do some research. Uh, and one of the things that we found out is that you can reset these bulbs. So you just power it off and on using the light switch. Uh, I think it was five times, wasn't it, Brayden? Yeah. yeah. Uh, you do have to wait a little bit, so don't be too fast. Probably give it like a two count in between turning the switch off and on um, so you're not going too fast. Here you can see it wants me to tell the light location, so we'll say the office. I'll tell it, it never works when I say this, but... Put ceiling three in there, continue, continue, done. See, it added it as a nano leaf bulb here. Oh, there, it changed the name. There we go. And then what I'll go ahead and do is I like to, I control all these, there's six of them in here together. So we'll just group them all. Um, and we'll call them ceiling, done, close. And now we just have one set of ceiling lights that we can control. There we go, you probably saw it maybe get a little brighter. I don't know, can you tell in the video? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, and then we can change the colors using HomeKit. Uh, it's, it's nice. And then the other nice thing is you can use, you know, we've got the HomePod Mini over here, which has the thread chip in it. So it's like working over the thread network. You can see how fast it's working. Hey Siri, turn the office lights off. Pretty fast. You can see it's still like adjusting the mesh network with thread, um, but we are we are getting it there. Uh, and then the other thing that's probably worth looking at is just an Eve. You can go into thread network, and you can see ah, this the one we just added is connected via Bluetooth still, uh, but the rest of them are all thread endpoints. So that's kind of cool. I think it's a, a pretty cool home kit accessory that you can buy like given that price point at $19.99 per bulb I think it's one of the cheaper bulbs you can get out there like you could probably get a $10 bulb that's Bluetooth um, but given this is thread the responsiveness we're seeing from that thread network I think this is a great value this is an A plus uh, in my home kit home I think we'll be expanding and adding more of these uh, but I will say the availability is still a little off we we ordered these uh, it we had to wait a couple weeks to get it from the Apple store we also have the nano leaf essentials strip as well and we'll be doing a video on that maybe we'll do that next week either way thanks for 
tuning in and uh, watching along. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you like this kind of content, be sure to hit subscribe and hit that bell to be notified as we're putting this out, this content out every week. We're kind of toying with the idea of Friday or Saturday. If you have an opinion on when we should release this stuff, just leave it in the comments below. And if you have any questions, uh, we will be sure to address those in the follow-up light, LED light strip video that we do. So be sure to leave those questions below and uh, you know we'll, we'll try to get those answered for you. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Thank you.